Well, all right, good people. <laughs> Paul, the handsome one hearing here. Listen, the adventure begins. I always forget to do these leaving videos, but hey, we are at the airport and we are headed to TwitchCon 2022. And we're gonna take you guys with us. <laughs> you ready for an adventure? I sure am. As always, there'll be more. Hey, hey, good people, Paul, the handsome one Herring here. Hey, I'm, I'm still in the airport, guys. <laughs> and this is what's happening. Put $20 in this bad boy and she's a rolling. Hey, <laughs> listen, you guys wanna do what I do? Give me a call, 810-239-2901. And as always, there'll be more. Hey, hey guys, Paul the Handsome One Herring here, and I'm gonna show you where here is. Here is in front of the Heart Attack Cafe. I'm scared to go in. I'm scared. I'm scared. It says on the door, you might die before the check clear. No smile. I don't know, guys. I don't know. I'm thinking about it. And while I'm thinking about it, I want you guys to consider getting involved with public access television. 810-239-2901. Come on, guys. Join the vision. As always, there'll be more after this. <laughs> All right, guys. Listen, I, I, I went down. The heart attack place is right over there. But I, I wasn't feeling it. It was a whole lot of burgers. <laughs> and I wasn't feeling it. So I came over here uh, to get an ahi salad. Uh, I can't even remember the name of the place. Hold on a second. Oh, no. no I can view the menu, but I can't view the name of the show. Okay. All right. Well, while I got your attention, this is just the beginning of the uh, epic travels of all the handsome I'm hearing. We're going to uh, start here and hopefully end up in San Diego. And uh, I'm going to take you along. Yeah, yeah, that's what we're going to do. If we can survive this. Right. About 8 o'clock there. About 4 o'clock here. And I'm starting to feel it, so I'm gonna get some grub and probably chill, man. I've got a long uh, couple of days ahead of us. But as always, if you want to get involved with public access television, give us a call 810 239 2901. There'll be more after this. Everything from my family, I won't think twice. Having sons didn't change my life to save my life. I don't even give a what no one says. I'm 
I'm hitting with my truth at the end of the day. And if that's you, it's your choice. Then do me a favor right now and make some noise. Everybody out there, you know what? I'm gonna tell you guys exactly what is up. They hate on you? Cool, no f Take a step back and put your middle finger up. Keep doing you until the day that you die. They're gonna try to harm you. Every day they'll try. But I'm gonna tell you right now, 215 is where I'm from and I'll keep it alive. Speaking my truth for both of my kids. And if you are a parent, you know what it is. Listen guys out there, I'm letting you know. Make some other noise if you enjoyed my show.
still in Vegas, baby. It's going to be a fabulous day. We're gonna get on the road. We're gonna head out and uh, probably stop by Henderson, a little casino there I like to go and leave a little money with. Then uh, maybe we'll check out the Hoover Dam and so on and so forth. But what we gotta figure out first is this. This guy's saying that he doesn't want it to leave the state. So I either have to find another one or another vehicle or something. Uh, but I'll keep you involved. Because <laughs> it's going to be a good day. So that said, if you guys are interested in getting involved with public access television, if you want to get your stuff on the radio, you got to give us a call. 810-239-2901. That's 810-239-2901. You know, don't just watch them. Make them. Fact Channel 17 needs your programming. WFOV, Our Voices Radio, needs your programming. 92.1 LP FM Flint. You get them at 810-259-9789. That's 810-259-9789 for WFOV and 810-239-2901. Respectable Productions and Channel 17. All right, guys. As always, there'll be more. someone here and here still in Las Vegas actually I just stopped at a restaurant to have some breakfast I got the ahi sandwich with a side of fruit and hold on wait a minute let me see if I can flip this thing around it's breakfast guys so in the comments what I want you to do is I want you to guess how much number eight paid for breakfast in Las Vegas <laughs> I'm upside down. I think I'm upside there. I'm right side up now. So let me catch you up on the scoop. I went to go get the vehicle from uh, my Turo uh, rental, and I got there. The guy asked me where I was going, and I said San Diego, and he said no. Was it? Beg your pardon? He says no. You can't take it out of the state of Nevada. I says uh, I don't understand. Your 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 ad didn't say that. Uh, blah blah blah, and such and such. He says, let me make a phone call. So he goes, makes a phone call. He's probably on the phone 10 minutes. Go to his house, walking around the parking lot. I'm just being cool, calm, and collective, you know. Tis what it tis. So he finally comes, he backs it back into the parking spot. So I'm thinking it's over, that it's not going to happen. By the way, the guy is from Detroit. His name is Dino. And I believe he's Greek. And I don't know that. Those of you who know me know that one of my best friends is uh, uh, Constantine Ananopoulos and Akasa, I get his last name wrong, but his nickname was Dino, and I shared that story with him. Also, he's a cop from Rochester Hills, and I let him know that my dad was in the uh, Detroit Police Department, so he likes me. He likes me, and he decided that uh, it was okay to go to San Diego, but when he turned the headlines on for the inspection, one of the six light bulbs <laughs> didn't come on. So he asked me if I would be patient and let him fix that before I took off. Told him no problem. And that's how I ended up here. The protein house. Never heard of it. Um, seems kind of cute. Uh, looking for franchisee. Do a lot of smoothies. Uh, it seems like a healthy place to eat. But oh. man. Right, good people. Paul the handsome one hearing here and here, here is the protein house in Las Vegas, Nevada. I just, I told you, I showed you what I did, what I got already. So that's the remnants of it. And the person you have to blame is sitting here with me. I'm gonna interview her right now and you guys can check this place out. Hold so I'm showing them the carnage that took place with this sandwich that I got from you. I got, uh, what is it, the Ninja? The Ninja Burger. Tell me about the Ninja Burger. Well, Ninja Burger is a different burger, right? With tuna, ahi tuna. And it's very clean, actually, because we cook differently mm -hmm. here. Why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself, a little bit about your background, okay. and why you did this? Um, my name is Larissa Rice. I'm from Brazil, and I opened this restaurant nine years ago. 
I used to be a bodybuilding competitor for more than 13 years. That's how I did my whole life was competing. Um, I made the best shows in the world. I traveled the whole world um, meeting people. I used to be like a fitness celebrity, nice. traveling the world, meeting amazing people, competing and sharing the bodybuilding lifestyle, you know. But this was a long time ago. Now I'm a mom, I have three, two kids. <laughs> three two kids? kids. <laughs> two, two kids, I'm done. And now I'm focused here in my business. And, and, and I also now I'm a health coach. So I help people to get better and not Wait, 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 wait. you're, you're a health coach. <laughs> so there's an email address and an Instagram you can get. I have right? my website. Okay, what is that? Uh, it's my name, it's larissarace.com. Oh, you gotta spell that. It's L A R I S S A R E I S, larissarace.com. Nice. So, in my website, I need to update more, but it's about health coach, how to live a healthier life. Um, you know, ditch, ditching the ditching the, the medicine because most of the time you don't need it. Most of the time it's the food, it's the stress, it's your lifestyle, right? So we need to have a, a change in lifestyle so we can change anything we are having problems with. Well, I like what you said about the vicious cycle. You yes. know, you got the food that's being made in the laboratory. Yes. That gets us sick, yeah. which sends us to the doctor, yeah. which prescribes medication. Yeah, because I believe, be like a lot of people believe too, it's everything comes from one family, right? It's a big family that owns this whole thing, the media, the pharmacy, the food. So they control everything. So if you are um, want to do a healthy choice, it's like more holistic, they don't approve and they create that culture that let's say I wanna like say let's say you have a cancer, right? Mm -hmm. And you wanna treat your cancer naturally. Right? Everybody in your family is gonna say you're crazy because they create that mentality for us to believe that our body is not capable to heal. But our body is capable to heal through our mind, mouth and mind. You know, so you really has because this whole thing is to make us sick, worry, stress it, right? And they don't want you to know that your body heals itself. Everything that we put in our mouth goes to our gut. So our gut is our second brain. So if you eat bad things, you can have a leak gut, and then that's the start all the problems. So first thing we would say is to change your lifestyle, right? What do you eat? Do you, do you eat a lot of foods inside the package? Or you cut fruit, vegetables? How, how's your lifestyle? You know, my lifestyle was horrible. I was eating a lot of foods out of the package. For how I many years? 60. 60. <laughs> I've been eating a little better in the last three or four years. Lots of nuts, lots of pistachios, almonds, asparagus, Brussels sprouts. Vegetables. Stuff like that. I'm still doing the pork and I'm still doing the fried chicken and the occasional Wendy's chicken sandwich. That, that's the problem with those things. I'm glad that you know it's bad because the oil use they use is very inflammatory. So if you are already sick and you eat those foods that already is inflammatory, what's going to happen to your body, right? That's when your body never going to heal. Right. Your body is like fighting to heal, but you don't let it heal. So for you to heal, the first thing I would say, you need to do a detox. Detox? Yes, a detox. So there is many different ways to do a detox. Uh, there is people that do with water and lime and a little bit of maple syrup, and they do that for 10 days. There is a book that talks about that. And that's all? That. You drink that yes. for 10 days alone? But I would suggest you to read the book first mm -hmm. to do correctly, right? Mm -hmm. You can do that. or. And you that's can, just one of many types of cleansers. Right? Yes. As and also that is cleanse? yes. And also that is um, juicy clean. You just drink juice for a couple of weeks. And you you're know, talking orange juice day. out of the grocery store? I thought no, that was horrible. No, yeah. it should be cold pressed, the ones we have here. Cold press. It's made fresh. Out of the, okay. Yes, nothing in a package. Even apple juice is bad? Yes. 
See, that was my go-to. Yes, I thought apple because, juice was good because for Because they you. put preservative to... You have to think about, this have a life shelf. It's going to spoil. You know, so it's not good for me. I, I eat as my... As I, I, I feel like. I'm more like more in the... Um, how to say, in the intuitive eating. Mm -hmm. um, but I think everybody's personality and also lifestyle is different. They need to to have a coach or somebody to to guide them. How so many what? gallons of water are you supposed to drink a day? At least one gallon. At least one gallon. At least one gallon. Give out your name, give out your email address, give out your website. Yes. Let's get people hip to this, yeah. okay? Well, my name is Larissa Reyes. I own a health food restaurant that we franchise as well. We have one in Dubai and uh, 11 across the country. Uh, ProteinHouse.com. You can find all the locations. We, we have amazing news for real people that cares about their health because I care about my family health. My family is here every day and I care about everyone's health. What can I say? All right, I'm headed out of Vegas. I think I'm gonna go to Henderson. May go to the Hoover Dam. Don't know, but I'm gonna take you with me. All right, so as always, there'll be more. Good people. <laughs> Listen, Paul the Handsome One here in here uh, with a, a special opportunity for you. Uh, actually, that was given to us. YouTube has invited us to participate in the sponsorship program. So they are, have set up uh, some kind of system to allow you guys to support the channel. Uh, there should be a button down here somewhere. Join, support, sponsor. Uh, click it. <laughs> See what it says. Uh, I, I want to assure you that all the content that we always do uh, is still going to remain for you. Don't have to be a sponsor or a supporter to enjoy what we do here at Spectacle Productions, but you can be extra appreciated if you do. All right, down here, join, sponsor, <sighs> see what happens. All right, um, we're also considering starting a new show for those that do choose to sponsor, and we're calling it the Meeting After the Meeting. And we'll allow you to be guests and hosts and help come up with the content and not maybe make you a star. I do not know. All right. But rest assured, I'm enjoying the life I'm living just until I can live the life I'll enjoy. And your support and our sponsorship will get us even closer to that. Remember, there'll be more, as always, after this. And, and after this, this is your life. God bless. Peace.